and now the Sky Force take a three-point lead over Windy City. Inside pass, Alfonso McKinney, and he repays the and one favor. Or at least you'll have your best friend be named Yogi. Bynum backwards pass, Alfonso McKinney from three, and he buries it. Alfonso McKinney with a three. With just over two minutes left to go, the Bulls have seven on the shot clock. Saunders finds his way inside to Alfonso McKinney, who keeps his balance and puts it away for two. Shooting just under 50% after the last make. Alfonso McKinney takes it away. Nobody in front of him, and that's going to get the crowd on their feet. Alfonso McKinney with the dunk. And you're right, some when you talk about beating yourselves, the Sky Force had two technical fouls in the first half, so you got to watch out for that. As Alfonso McKinney, there's the alley-oop we've been looking that for. Oop, almost there. Is, of course, you got another. So Darrell Eddy dribbles up, moves in, goes back to Alfonso McKinney. Makes sure he's behind the three-point line and switch. Crosses the timeline back to go on defense. And now he'll be tested as Benson has it with him defending. Oh, goes over the top of him and knocks it out of bounds. V.A. Dukin finally makes his way back into the ball game. Goes inside for McKinney. Three-point shot. Octius showing the range. John Octius moving around seven seconds on the shot clock for Alfonso McKinney from 17 feet out. And another shot is good for number 34. It's not open. He can find an opening with his by using that muscle, that huge that body of his. Benson wasn't ready for that pass. They got McKinney with a man helping, but he takes it away himself in the ball. The first time. I'm not sure if he got blocked or just missed, but Saunders corrals it, turns around. McKinney's open for three in the corner. High arching shot, and he buries it. Alfonso McKinney pulls the Bulls within four. His uh, agent never told him about it, so as a result of this, they decided to part ways. Alfonso McKinney knocks down a three.